Let's go to the business that's gone belly up and ruined Christmas for many Australian families. It's called Kids Outdoors. It was selling cubby houses online. But instead of making a child's dream come true, it's taken mum and dad's money and disappeared. The short story is we spoke to the faceless, no appearance neb outside his house on the phone. Hasn't got the baubles to face us in person. Mate, do you going to make yourself available uh, for an interview with me? He's a strange bloke, Neville. Very strange bloke. This morning he agreed to be interviewed, but he didn't want to be identified. So to avoid that, his suggestion is that he dresses as Santa Claus, as Father Christmas, in the full Santa suit. Because that'd be so appropriate. So what's he worried about? A public caning? You, you, even on TV you said I was a strange bloke. I've actually got a job. I work at the Bayside Shopping Centre in Frankston as the, the resident Santa where kids have their photos taken with me. That's what I've been reduced to. I've had to get a job. So you, you're the, what, in which store? Bayside Shopping Centre. Now to the Rogue Cubby House Company and the... To the Rogue Cubby House, that's not very nice, Martin. But you are a rogue, mate. I mean, let's not play games with each other. Are you going to be interviewed today or not? Yeah. When Martin King showed you this picture yesterday, mm -hmm. what did he actually ask you? He asked me if I knew that guy. Okay. And if that was one of our Santas. Really? I said no. Can you tell me what it said? It was rude. I won't say it in front of kids. Really? Yeah. Do you want to step aside and tell me? Um, it just, it had something about it being said in the or something like that. Really? Yeah. Yeah. There was that go. it? Yeah. So he showed you a picture that said, imagine yes. massive yeah. cock below. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. So you've not supplied kids outdoors with any kind of timber for over a year? Yep. Okay. Yeah. You have you have made the figure available somewhere where uh, the public can actually, if somebody was looking for the amount. Credit check on them. Yes. I believe our solicitor, the way he works, um, registers the deck because it's a public thing. Yes. Um, and we do that so if they want to count somewhere else. Yep. He will never go to do anything else in their life. Yep. We have uh, a direct uh, guarantee. Yes. So as long as we know their address, we can continue to pursue them. It's not just the kids and the parents who've been let down this Christmas. Might at 10 supplied kids outdoors with most of the wood for the cubby houses. And guess who's been left with a mega debt? That debt is $30,000, with other creditors coming out of the woodwork. Reason.